testing my mic. And I think we're good. I'm just testing the sound. Sound is working. All right, folks. So we're back here with uh, Pokemon Emerald. Just checking my webcam to make sure I look like a crazy person with wild hair. Good. And uh, back here with Pokemon Emerald. So a couple things I did just quickly bef uh, to summarize in while well, actually while Cam was playing through last night. Um, I did go to the Space Center, uh, like he did in his stream, and I did grab um, the HM08, which is Dive, from this guy, Steven, who we've met several times now, um, at his house. And after doing that, I went back into the ocean, found a spot with deep water, and I dove in. And that actually brought me here, which is a suspiciously... Um, cave-like looking thing. Have not actually gone in there yet, but I'm pretty sure I know what it's about. Because I think it looks suspicious enough. So let's go in and let's find out what's going on here. Oh yeah, um, shout out quickly to uh, Noah. Today we got to play a little bit of Zom's Royale. You can watch that recording, um, the recording of that stream on the Firestorm channel as well but that was pretty cool and we're definitely going to try to do that again at some point so let's go in this cave let's see what's going on in here do -do -do. ah okay so we did manage to find submarine let's see can we just aha we found team aqua so they must have gone ashore here i think that means we can now surface uh, no. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. Uh, Pokemon... I had to teach Dive to Swampert. Who also knows Rock Smash now. Aha! Okay, so it looks like this does appear to be the place. Just look around and make sure there's not anything else to explore. Nope, nope, we're good. So let's go right in. Oh... My god. Okay, so we can break this. Yep. So we got Swampert with the Rock Smash. Had to teach Swampert Rock Smash because we have lost... Um, we no longer have... What's his name? On the team. Slackoth. No, let's put that there. Ah, gonna have some Agua battles. Okay. And uh, we don't need to get around going home already. Okay. Yeah, because we lost Slack off from the team, I did teach Rock Smash to um, Swampert, which also gives him a fighting move, which is not necessarily something he needed, but is replacing like a 25 power ground move, and he has another ground move. So that should all be fine. Main carry right now is Manectric, um, level 47 at this point. Got to do some leveling last night. So that is great as well. All right. So we beat our first grunt. Um, okay. So darn it. Okay. Encounter Zubat. Yeah. Shot. Boom. Okay. So that brings us through there. And I'm going to fight this guy. Calendar's reminding me to stream Emerald. I think I got it. Um, we're gonna fight this guy. It's tiny and <laughs> Yeah, that, that did not look, uh, that did not look big enough to be, uh, to hold all of these people. <coughs> yeah, Zom, Zom's Royale, Cam. You gotta get in on the, the hot new trend. It's a top-down 2D, uh, battle royale. It's gonna be lots of fun. And, yeah. Okay, so we're gonna go see what's out here. Oh man. Oh man. This is gonna be... Oh my god. Okay, so what we're gonna do... Yep. <coughs> Manectric. By the way, it's Manectric that knows strength. Um... 
Oh my god, this is gonna be such a complicated base. So, yeah. Uh, just shockwave through that, do that. Yeah, thank you, Cam. Um, I will make sure only to catch one Pokemon in. Oh my god, where? This feels like so many dead ends. Yes. Have I been here before? No. Okay. Well. Okay, I hate this. This is the worst. <laughs> Alright. So, we already fought you. Right. Oh, so that brings us back around to here. And we already fought that guy. Okay. So what we're going to do... Yes, they do have the same battle pass icon. Um, it is different. I mean, the, the graphics and everything is very different. Um, it's also just a little quicker in general to get into matches and so on and so forth, which is kind of nice. Okay, now this way, I don't actually think I can get over there. Oh, wait. Yeah, I can. Okay, so... Oh, not that way. Okay, so we're gonna go down this tunnel first since it seems... Yep, I, I guess so. Okay, so... I think no matter where I go from here, I'm winding up on that tile. And honestly, no matter where I go from here, I'm winding up somewhere up here. Let's try going this way. Nope. Okay. So we'll go to the right then. Got it. <laughs> okay. And that brings us over here. Which is the fucking entrance? What? That doesn't make any sense. Okay, that actually doesn't make any sense. But sure. <sighs> okay, so we need to not go in that opening of the thing. Well, lesson learned. Rock smash that, and then we need to push this guy. Okay, and now we can push this guy into that spot, and then go up here. Okay. Great. Okay, this is not an ice puzzle. So... I'm gonna go back in here because I figure. Yeah, this is probably the place to go, sure. And then we hop on there, and we go to there. <coughs> we went here. And we found out last time if we went to the right, we went all the way around. I would eventually like to be over there on the left, so I'm gonna actually try going down. Nope, that brings me back there. Okay. No, you guys are saying this is my kryptonite, which it is. But I'm going to try to logic my way through this this time. Aha. A fucking tentacle, of course. No, there's no ice here, so I'm fine. Um, okay, we made it to the door. Okay, what? I'm not doing that. That does mean I have to fight this as a double battle, but it's worth it to me. It's worth it. How did you manage to get here without a submarine? What an impressive child. I mean, I got a Swamper, and for some reason he knows how to scuba dive. So there's that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you guys celebrating me making it through that? Yeah, I'm honestly kind of impressed with myself. I didn't think I'd make it through. Out comes Sharpedo, and 
Mighty Yina. So here's what we're going to do. Well, that sucks. Attack is down. So we'll use... Actually, not going to use Shockwave, but we will use Thunder on that Sharpedo, and Pelipper is just going to slam everybody with Surf. That should take out Sharpedo. Since it hit, which was lucky, because that's a 70% accuracy rate. Now I'm assuming they have a second... Yeah. And it's great that they're both out, because now hopefully I can kill them both with Surf. Okay, just nobody on my team has any attack right now, but that's fine. Because Surf don't scale off attack. <coughs> and that was a crit on one Mighty Yena. Is that crit on both then, or just... Nope, not necessarily, apparently. So I guess Surf doesn't crit both necessarily. Cool. And out comes a Golbat. We can take care of Golbat pretty quick. Um, hopefully we land this Thunder. Otherwise, just going to use a wing attack and try to finish him off. Okay, that hits. Super effective. Nice. And Shelly and Grunt were defeated. Cool, cool. How are there 102 players in a 100-person game? Good question, Cam. Nobody knows. Sounds like you need to get some more elims. Yeah, Cam, my best game today, I got six kills. What, what? Okay, this is hell. Who designed this? <laughs> Why would someone do this? Bless you. Okay, so we're gonna use strength. But first, we need to use shockwave. So it's a big boulder, it can push it aside, yeah. Great. Okay, so we're gonna push that one up. I think I blocked the entrance off. Okay, and back out we go. And back in. So we're going to try this again. Uh, this time... Yeah, I think this is my personal hell. <laughs> but... this one down. I'm going to do that twice. Except that now blocks the entrance. That's not good. Can push it. No, can't push it again. Hmm. We've done this wrong. Yep. All right, let's try this one again. Two options. No, we don't. 
I actually have more than two options. Do it? Yeah. I don't know why I think this is a good idea. Nicely organized. So that didn't work. Okay. Can't move the center one. Center one's going to cause a lot of problems if I move it. I got no idea what to do here. Can I do anything? The middle side rock. I have to push both middle side rocks up. Yeah. Yeah. But that means getting down. Yeah. I think I get it. No, I don't think I do push the middle for it. Well, this middle. Yeah. And now that. And now that. And then that one. And then that one. And now I can push the middle. Ha ha! Beat you, puzzle! Alright. And of course, this freaking zoom at. Alright, and we're through to this place where there's an item. Oh, we got Earthquake. That's gonna come in clutch. Okay. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, it's Kyogre. Behold, I am beholding. Hey, I do have see how beautiful it is. This is just like right here, like. That, I mean, anyone with an IQ over 500 could have gotten past that boulder puzzle. I I don't know how I got through the boulder puzzle. <laughs> okay, so we got a mighty Yina. We are almost out of Thundershocks. That's not Thundershock. Damn. We're almost out of Thunder Wave? No, what is that? Shockwave? Shockwave. Almost out of Shockwaves, so... 
gonna rely on Thunder as much as I can through this fight. Oh wow, good chunk of exp. About to use Crobat, no I will not. I'm gonna try to land another Thunder. Oof, please don't flinch, please don't flinch, please don't flinch. Okay, those bites are hitting like a truck, but Thunder hits the flying type harder. And we're good. Thunder has crazy power, it's 120, and this Manectric does have a pretty high special attack stat. Mm. No way. Not changing Pokemon for a Sharpedo. What we are gonna do is hit him with a full wow. Ouch. <clears throat> and it's a hit, so that should be a KO. Very nice. Oh, and I see that Cam said he's not gonna watch. He did not watch the boulder puzzle. So he can uh, figure it out tomorrow, which I highly recommend, because it's, it's a tricky one. Foo foo foo, I commend you. I must recognize that you're truly gifted. Thank you, I was in the gifted and talented program at my school as my 11 year old self. But I have this in my possession. With this red orb, I can make Kyogre uh-oh. They need to stop doing this. Because this is going to make these big Pokemon real mad. See, he's mad now. He's going to go do Orca stuff. I love it when Kyogre glows like that. It's such a cool like little effect. What? I didn't do anything. Why did the Red Orb? Because... <sighs> of course it's raining heavily. That should count as Rain Dance, by the way. Yep. Of course it's raining harder than you envisioned because your hubris has put all of humanity in danger. No, it's not. It's supposed to make him go crazy. Oh. I hope you guys have like a whole showdown or something. That'd be cool. Don't get all high in my... Oh my god. You can't control it. There's no way. Okay, we're all getting out of here. Yeah, this ain't good. You did make a horrible mistake. You should not have done this. Yeah. This is very bad. They have ups actually you guys have upset the balance of nature, really, is what happened. Oh, it's Steven. What's up, Steven? After the terrible scorching wave ended, the deluge began. All of Hoenn know the whole world will drown, that's not gonna be good. Huge rain cloud is spreading from above. Setopolis. Yeah. Guess we gotta go to Setopolis. No idea how to get there. Hi Maria, I'm kind of kind of busy right now. Okay, so yep. What I'm gonna have to do is check my map. Um, that's not my map. Okay, so I am here. Setopolis is right up there. I do at some point I think have to go to the Evergrande because there's a gym there. So I might try to find my way there now, question mark. Oh, can people stop calling me? Oh. Hmm. Okay, goodbye Wingle. I don't have time to like, do Wingle fights right now. Wait, why is the sunlight harsh? Isn't it raining badly enough to threaten the world? <coughs> Again, what? Ah. Okay, it's fine. Why is it? I'm confused by the weather right now. Uh, 
this is the Evergrande. Oh, right, forgot. Can't get up the waterfall here. So, I'm gonna go back. Oh, I see what's happening. So, it's like alternating harsh sunlight and then terrible rainstorms. There's a freaking developer. Okay. So, I guess in that case, I actually should go to Cetopolis. So, I guess now it's not gonna be raining anymore. Yeah, super harsh out. Uh, we attack. Just trying to skip through these battles. Not battles, but encounters. Y'all don't need to see all that. We just need to get to Setopolis. Which we don't really know where that is. Oh my god, release me. Freaking tentacles. Wing attack! Okay. And maybe this is towards it? I don't know. We'll see. This looks promising. Big help. Okay. Wing attack. Shut up, Wingle. Okay. Problem is, don't know how to get up this big help. Well, tricky. Tricky there. Okay, I can't get around that one. Uh, shut up, one goal. Uh, the effects in the game are getting very chaotic. This maybe is Cetopolis, maybe is not. I don't know, but I can't get up there, so. You're a mermaid? That doesn't seem correct. I think your understanding of yourself is incorrect. Sunland is strong, which boosts the power of the pelican type. Oh man, he knows rollout. It is? What type is rollout? No, seriously, what type is rollout? Can someone answer that in the... Is it ground? Ground wouldn't be strong against a pelican. Um, yeah, we're good. I like that Spiel just comes in and his animation is just him rolling. It's one of my favorite animations from Gen 3 when Pokemon comes in. It's just the Spiel rolling around. Okay, cool. That gets me through that. <clears throat> really do not want to waste time on these random encounters. I am going to check my book enough. Okay, so that is definitely Cetopolis. But I have no idea how to actually get onto Cetopolis. Okay. And so that is a problem. Yeah, yeah. I like how he has a whole Gyarados, like, really? <sighs> but why is normal super effective against my- well, whatever. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Wing attack. Okay, can't go that way. I did not watch that part. Is it a dive thing, Cam? You don't have to tell me how to get in. I just want to know if it's a dive thing or not. I'm feeling it is. Okay, so we're down here. Yay, okay. And let's go back up. I like that I can just stay down here and... Oh, can't use that here. Okay, so how about over here? Oh, got it. 
So that's probably not the right way to go. <clears throat> Maybe I need to get over there. Okay, so let's try, let's just go in this big trench. Yep. Okay, this is a big trench. Chinchow. Chinchow Gen 2. Oh, there's a cavern. Groudon picked a questionable place to make this stand. Holy crap. They are mad at each other. Yeah, again, if I were Groudon... Uh... Why don't you just go talk to these people before I do something? I did it. I'm seeing that with my very own eyes. Never expected to witness something this huge. Um, go for it, red Pokemon. Don't back off, blue Pokemon. I I actually do. They're Kyogre and Groudon. It'll get wrecked. No, it actually seems fine. It's literally just raining. A big Pokemon is fine. <laughs> Why did none of these people know the names of the... The legendary Pokemon, they should know them. Yeah, sure. Why does it tell me that the water is dyed a deep blue every time? <laughs> no, they're not angry. Um, they seem kind of angry. Yes. No, I am not prepared to be part of this crisis. Wait, Steven, let's go to the CVS, the Pokemart. Where? Um, no, I actually, I want to catch them. Where are we going? This whole city is one giant puzzle. Um... Wallace. He's talking about Wally? Yeah, of course there's a Zubat in here. A cave within a cave? Really, guys? Okay. Cave of Origin. Still in the Cave of Origin. This is the red side of the Cave of Origin. Ah, okay. My name is Wallace. He's the gym leader, but something came up. Man, this is like that lighthouse bullshit in the last generation. Juan is the new gym leader? Okay. Groudon and Kyogre are considered to be super ancient. <coughs> Not just regular ancient, super ancient. But there aren't just two super ancient Pokemon. There's one more somewhere. Gosh, I wonder where he is. Uh, it is E to revive on Zom's Royale, which I cannot believe I'm giving advice on right now. But there you go. Flynn, do you perhaps know where Rayquaza is now? I actually do. Um, he's at the Sky Pillar. I, I don't... Where is the Sky Pillar? Because I actually don't know where that is. <laughs> I maybe shouldn't have told him that he was at the Sky Pillar, because I don't don't actually know where that is. Great. <coughs> no one's helpful. Well, I'll just have to find my way through the puzzle. Uh, is there a poke center around here somewhere? 
Let's see a Pokemon art. Focus center. these guys. Nope, dead end. Okay. Good to know. Just hoping I can fly back here. So, oh, the gym is over there. Is there a poke center over there too? No Poké Center over here. Sure. <coughs> Ancient Pokémon fighting out in the field. I'm just walking around. Ah, Poké Center. Great. Oh no, I know. You were just asking, so. Uh... Yep, they they did. I don't know. We'll. Uh... Not to see. I believe it is because of those Pokemon, I think. But, uh... Interested in seeing if I can actually challenge the gym right now. Hmm. Okay, so I can't. That's a, that's a real bummer. Squeeze right by you guys, real quick. Uh, yeah. Okay, so go back into the, this thing. Go out here. Can I come back up? Okay, and we're out. So, how do we get to passive in Logtown? No idea if that's how you pronounce it. Can I go? What if I dive here? Can I go to the left? I cannot. But maybe there's a way around. No? There is not. You can X to <clears throat> Okay, so that's not our way out. Not way out. Hmm. How about here? Sure. Nope, this is that same well not really the same, but Same stretch. So it's looking like a no go. Interested in two things. First of all, can we fly? Yes, we can fly to Satopolis. Second of all, can we fly to Sleepport? Because I think we can take that stream of water now to Pacifid. Pacifid? Pacifid? No, wait, can't go this way. No. What about up here? Yes. Alright. Ah, we're on our way, but there's stuff. Hmm.
tools. Before we finish making the ship. <coughs> That's interesting. That's not what he said last time. I should go to the shipyard and check on the progress of that ship. This is not the shipyard. This is the shipyard. Go back there. It's the veteran sailor, it's coming together. Good. Yep. <clears throat> it would. Yeah. Do I have to like keep waiting for you guys to build this thing? Because I'd, I'd like to go to Passive Log Town. Hmm. Good. Good point there. Don't you think it's strange that a ship... Yeah, I know how that works. It's like if display... displacement is more than the weight of the ship, then the ship floats. Otherwise it sinks. How do you get to that guy? Oh, that's downstairs. This is upstairs. Okay, so this was kind of a dead end. Should be able to get there. Should be able to. Maybe I'll fly back to Moss Deep. Of course. Okay. Let's go. So we need to go south first. South a bunch. Going south. There is no more south. Okay. Interesting changing weather. This is kind of cool because the technically, if I were using water types, I guess that would affect the strength of the moves. I think if it's ever raining, then thunder doesn't miss, <coughs> which might be wrong, but it seems right. So let's run to the south of this and we'll surf again. Try to go south as far as I can, so we're in route 129 now. Alright, just pump her down. Dope. Now let's try to head west for a little bit again. Aha! Seems right. Huh? Yeah? Yeah, we're going west for a while, so that seems promising. Let's see where we are on the map. Alright. Should be about halfway there. these swimmers as much as possible. 
Aha. <clears throat> okay, so I'm the Pokemon Fan Clubs, the chairman's younger brother. Yeah, I know. It's Ooh, TM27, is that returning? Yeah. Cool, thanks. I like how they didn't bother to program different dialogue options. They just said he talks about both return and frustration. Interesting. Good to know. Look, a Poké Center. Well, oh yeah, the Reggies. Yeah, six dots open three dots. Six dots open three doors. Yeah, you're right. But I uh, don't really have time to do the whole Reggie puzzle right now, so I'm not going to do that. We. Uh, this is Route 132. I can't really get over. Hmm. I have a feeling that if I surf here, I'm going to get swept back to Slateport. Let's see. Oh, no, this guy. Fisherman Ronald would like to battle. Out comes Magikarp. Take care of him with the shockwave. And Gyarados comes out. Whatever will we use against Gyarados? Shockwave. Gyarados again. We will use Shockwave. And here comes Gyarados. Really? One Pokemon team. Okay. <laughs> and another Gyarados. Shockwave. And a fifth Gyarados. Great. And they all had Intimidate. Bummer. Okay, so we wound up on this little island. Ah! Take him out. Okay. Ooh, level 50! Sweet. Okay, so we got a high-powered Manectric. Oh. Uh, so that's one place that I could wind up. Let's just... Uh, this is going to take me back to... Oh, no, nope, not yet. Found a rare candy. Excellent. Oh man, can't get to that guy. Alright, let's see where I wind up. Yeah, it looks like it takes me straight back to Slateport. No, maybe, I don't know. You've been expecting me. You're literally treading water in the middle of the ocean. Doesn't make any sense. Okay. Ah, ball. Cool, cool. Oh. <coughs> Might as well surf again. I love this. Him and the neck trick. Okay. Yep, let's go. And there it is. Take them out. Okay, so I am sick of being lost. But, oh man. Darn.
Okay, that brings me back to slate port. At which point I should be able to fly back to Pacific Block Town. Sweet. Alright. Let's talk to this guy. Sky Pillar. Hmm. Okay, so that was a useful hint, sort of. Now we're here to talk to you guys. I'm guessing that the Sky Pillar is this thing to the north. How the heck to get there? Do not know. Okay, so we're gonna try to go around Log Town. Okay, zap zap gets us through. Come on. So going around. Oh, oh, gotta be a little careful not to go into the tide. See, I can get right up to it. Or at least I can get up to this thing. But I can't seem to get anywhere that seems to get me anywhere. Hmm. Assuming this is it. Maybe it's not. Try to go down as far as we can, and then go across. Okay, so we did that. Oh, interesting. So that kind of forces us now towards the top end of things. Is there a way we can stay on the bottom? I think we did the bottom paths last time. Yeah. So this is not super working out. <coughs> and fly back. This is the one place I haven't really looked yet. Oh, damn it. Thunder. Okay. Okay. That does that. something. Ah. Okay. This is looking good. 
Who the heck is that? It's Wa how did you get here, Wallace? I mean, she probably he probably knows his way around. Okay, not a moment to lose. So, yep, better hurry up. That was pretty crazy. It, it really is. It's gonna spread all through Japan. Okay, so Wally was not exactly a plus help. That wasn't Wally. That was Wallace. My bad. Uh, hold up. Oh man, he self destruct. Did he self destruct or did he curse? I'm not sure. Okay. Can't, okay, can't rock smash. Wait, can I rock smash this one? Nope. What? Wait, what? So we found our way to Sky Pillar. We're working our way up the stairs. There's a lot of stuff to do here. Oh my, oh my god. <gasps> it's Rayquaza! You lit up! Oh my god, don't no, get me out of here. <laughs> okay. That feels like time to fly. to Cetopolis. Okay, so we got Kyogre and Groudon fighting it out. Boom, boom, boom. Animation. Pokemon 16-bit. Whoa. Okay, so Rayquaza shows up. He's like, yo, I'm a dragon. And he makes Rainbow Road. He comes down from the sky in a giant beam of light. He's like green, yellow, and red. He's a full stoplight. He's like, okay. Stop fighting. <laughs> Kyogre just goes under the water. <laughs> Groudon just backs up. I don't know where he went since there's not any land in anywhere around here. All right, so we we did the thing. The water is like glass. Yeah, sure. We. Okay, no more Kyogre, no more Groudon. Flynn! They didn't mean any harm. They're fine. No punishment. So that's Rayquaza. It's incredible how they fled from it. Can I fight the gym now? Thanks to you two walls. Now I have HMO7, which is probably Waterfall, I think. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, it's Waterfall. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I think it's here. I have to beat Juan. <coughs> you know what? Did I actually go to the Poke Center? Yep. Pokemon. I did not. I want to do that. Since I'm gonna need my boy uh, Manectric to do this next fight.
really like Rayquaza. He was cool. Helped bring balance to the force and all that jazz. Okay, let's go. Whee. Yep. Pelper use Surf. Whee. Okay. And in we go. Oh no. Wait, what? What? Oh, so the ice broke. Got it. Okay, how do I know when the ice is gonna break? Okay, out comes Love Disc. Go Manectric. Shockwave. Bazinga. And that deals with Love Disc. It's super effective. Oh, that, that was it. Those were the techniques she learned from the gym leader. Send out your love disc, get it one hit KO'd in the first round, and then lose. Immediately. Actually, please don't teach me how harsh battles can be. Please lose to me. <clears throat> Let's see. Beauty Connie sent out Goldine. Goldine, Goldine, Goldine. We're going to use Thunder, which hits... And that's a dead gold. Just like every goldfish the day after Christmas. And Connie is down. Push on ahead. There's that slidey ice I was expecting. Okay, so that ice breaks. Wait, what? Okay. Oh, I can't go up. It's weird. Okay, this is confusing. Hmm. So if you step on it twice, then it breaks. But I can't seem to go up this ice. Uh, can I use my bike? Hmm. Okay, not the place for the bike. Can't run either. Mark is correcting my pronunciation. Rayquaza? I always used to say Rayquaza, but then Cam said no. How are we going to do this? Ah! Oh. Oh, this is like a puzzle puzzle. Okay, I get it. So you have to step on all the ice things, except for the rocks. Cool. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna make it through this one. We got this, we got this. Yes, yes. Puzzle, first try. Let's go. <sighs> he taught Wallace everything he knew about being a gym leader? No. I did have fun, Noah. Wait, is the, who is this? This is Leader Juan. 
Juan, I'm so sorry, but I have an electric type. You are my cousin's uncle's father's college roommate. So what does that make us? Absolutely nothing. Oh, that's a wish cat. Uh, you know what? I actually should have switched Pokemon to my Pelipper. Oh! <laughs> okay, wait. Mark's joke is great. I didn't catch it at first. He said it was a pun about restoring balance to the Force, because Rayquaza brought balance to the Force. And he's like, Ray, like from Star Wars, Ray Quaza. That's actually really good. I'm mad at myself for missing that the first time. What? Why does he take that little damage? Wing attack. I guess flying is immune to ground, but not necessarily strong? Juan is precious. I appreciate that he's like kind of Okay, I no longer like Juan. <laughs> I do not like Juan anymore. He just used my least favorite thing. He did the bad. He used a hyper potion, and now I must destroy him. Surf is normal strength against Whiskash, who is both water and ground type, which is strong against my... Oh, he's using a Celio? Yup. We gonna switch today to Manectric. Now it is raining, I think, because Whiskash used. And rain falling means thunder can't miss, so we're gonna use that. That was a tactical error on his part. I like in um, Pokemon Showdown when they do the animations, the, like, the Thunder Strike will literally miss. Like, it'll it'll actually go. Because in these games, when you, like, miss, it just won't show you the attack. But in Showdown, if you miss with a move like Thunder, it'll show the Thunderbolt. It just will be literally off the Pokemon. So, yeah, Rain continuing to fall is working well in my favor here because I can spam Thunder all I want and it won't miss. Clutch. And again, that is a 120 power move. Kingdra. Will I change Pokemon? Kingdra is a dragon, isn't he? I think, yeah, Kingdra is water dragon. Oh, rain stopped, so I'm going to switch over to chocolate. Regardless of his dragonness, he is still a water type, so. Oh, does dragon resist electric? I guess it must. Alright, we're still gonna body this. Okay. Well, he's gonna gain all his HP back, but that's fine. Let's see if we can hit with a thunder. Oh, that's actually really smart. And it missed, so we're gonna hope that it. Oof. That's gonna hurt. Okay. I wish I had Ice Beam against this uh, dragon type. And that's a whole heap of damage. And it's paralyzed. Clutch. Okay. So no move that time, which is great. Gonna try another Thunder, because I figured that the Hyper Potion was coming. Yeah. Great. We do land another Thunder, which is good. He is already paralyzed. That's a lot of health taken off. Uh, it's gonna miss, yeah. Okay, no move that time. Might be another Hyper Potion coming. Nope. But it is a rest. Great. Yep. We are running out of Thunders here. But that one hits, so that's good. Okay, drops him pretty low. 
he's fast asleep. He does not have that chest berry anymore. He already ate it. So let's hope that we land this one. We landed it. Great. And that clears Juan. Oh, of course that one was the crit. 2,000 XP. Wow. That's a lot. You're lacking in elegance. Okay, Juan. Whatever, man. Give me that rain badge. Alright, I received the rain badge from Juan. Aw, oh, yeah. This will assure me the full obedience of all my Pokemon to my every command. Also allows the use of Waterfall to scale walls of cascading water. That means I can get into Evergrowing Day. So you never forget the battle we shared. Take this. TM03. This is... Eh? Uh, it is... Water Pulse. Meh. Hey Juan, how do I get out of here? <laughs> okay, I guess I'll just slide down. Okay. So that was easier than expected. We should still immediately go to the focus Center, though. All right, and we're just gonna heal up. Bazingo, goodbye. Okay, now, what we should do next is surf. Cause we can go down here. Oh, actually, yeah. So what I want to check is whether we can teach Waterfall to one of our Pokemon. I'm really hoping we can, so we don't have to go catch a... Swampert is able to do it. Swampert already knows Formos. Yes. Okay, so now we're at a bit of a crossroads, because... So how much... What's Waterfall's power? I think we're probably going to just forget Muddy Water. Yeah. Waterfall has slightly less power. But that's okay. For the maximum water power, we have Pelipper's Surf. And at this point, I think we can dive. Yep. So Swampert now knows three HM moves, which seems like a lot, but that's fine. I like this, uh, this music. It's kind of creepy. Okay, let's actually come up. We'll go this way. Ooh, level 52. Good job, Manectric. Uh, okay, I don't really care about them, so. And go this way. Don't care about that island. I have to care about the island. Have to care about the island. Not that way. So I have to go down this way. Damn. I'll do the end. Okay. Alright, can't go that way, so try going out. Back around, I guess. I know I've gotten into the I've gotten to the Evergrande waterfall before. Which I'm pretty sure is where I'm heading. Ah, oh, this is deep. Man. Maybe I need to go further south first. Oh, 
Oh my god. Okay, where am I going? The tentacles are not cool, man. They're like tenta uncools. Okay. I'm gonna run out of shockwaves before I'm out of this water. I'm in route. Oh, hey. Really? You sure about that? Oh my god. <laughs> Okay. Yes. Wow, this guy actually is pretty strong. Sur surprisingly. Okay. Well, that does him. Shiftry was a better opponent than I expected to face from some rando living on an island. But here we are, once again trying to head east. And desperately trying to find Evergrande. Okay, shockwave. And up. Uh huh? Under them. Okay. Yes! Swampert use waterfall. And up we go. Ta-da. Okay, lots of flowers here. And I see a Poke Center, so we're gonna go there. Okay, great. Woohoo! Okay. So that deals with that. And let's see what we're going over here. Evergrande City. Paradise Flowers Sea and Pokemon. Evergrande City. <laughs> Read that again. Entering Victory Road. Oh no, it's a puzzle. This is a new Victory Road. Wow. I... I don't... Oh, who's this? It's Wally. I am surprised to see you here. I... You're like a child. Oh man, really? He's got Altaria right off the bat. Uh, Shockwave. Hell yeah. Oh. Okay. Delcaddy, no. Fight, fight. Fight. Magneton coming out. Will I change Pokemon now? Um, strength? No, oh, against the steel? That was not a good idea. Let's see what's in the bag. Do we have a full restore? Because a full restore would be real nice right now. We do not full heal. I don't heal status problems. Right. I have paralyzed heal, so what I'm gonna do is slap a hyper potion on Nectric. <coughs> Moist. Try attack. Please don't freeze me. Please don't freeze me. Okay. And hit him with the old thunder. That was lucky. Okay. And now we need to use the parallel seal. Because pain. Yeah. Oh, why am I... Switch Pokemon. Swampert. Shift. Yes. Why am I... Derping around with. Can't hurt me with that, man. Okay, one thing I want to check out is. So, first of all, I'm pretty sure that. Oh, can't actually do anything right now with those. Let's use. This one. 
Super effective. Does, like, no damage. Defense fell. Oh, screech. Actually fell. I think he's probably got Levitate. Oh, nope. No Levitate. Great. Okay. So that takes care of Magneton. And that gains some exp, and some more exp, and coming out Resselia. Yes. We have an answer for Resselia in the form of a Pelican. Pelican type is strong against the plant type. Out comes Resselia. We will counter with a wing attack. Got him. Okay, and all right. Here comes Gardevoir, Psychic type. We have an answer for that. Because we've got Manectric. Who knows? Bite. Gardevoir. Nice. And flinched, which is great. We can use Bite again. That should take out our health, and we're good. Okay, Guard of Earthling. 53. Sweet, 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 sweet. I'm trying to learn Charge. Can't learn more than four moves. Yeah, let's see what Charge is. Charge's power to boost the electric move next. Uh, don't really think we need that. The only thing I'm thinking is that I could... Description. Do, 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 do. It deals twice the amount of damage. My thought is that I could double the power of Shockwave, but that kind of feels like a bit of a waste. I think it's a waste, because I still have Thunder for niche situations. Yeah. Alright. I am. What can I say? Uh, you most likely will not beat me ever. You are a child. Pokemon, out comes the Pelican, and let's hit him with ye old wing attack. What is ingrain? No, I don't like that. Planted its roots. There goes Rosalia. All right. Cool trainer hope. Battle style is fantastic. Okay. Uh God. Yeah.
down. Oh my god. Yeah, this is, uh, this is a challenge. Huh? A bridge here. If you didn't want to die to Shockwave, you shouldn't have been a Steel type. So there's that. Oh man. Uh, yeah. Now while dark something. Okay. That works. Kadabra. Why did it go up here? Man, that's annoying. Oh, might as well fight you. Uh, we need different Pokemon for this. Out comes Nine Tails. No, I will not. Tropius, yes. Actually, no. Need Pelibra out for the wing attack. Cool. Oh, good job, Pelber. Level up. Cool trainer Julie defeated. Another two thousand dollars. Yes. What? Okay, guess we're going up here. Oh my god. Okay. I don't I don't want to fight stabilize. Item! Item! Ooh, Psychic! I don't know if anyone on my team can actually learn that, but that's fine. Is this all that's on this level? No. so that I can keep swapping moves. Um, what is that? Oh my god, he tanked the hell out of that. Okay, Graveler coming out. Nah. Uh, okay, okay. Wailord coming out. Yep. I'll switch to Electric. Boom. Nice, a lot. And that's it. Oh, I just jumped over that. That probably wasn't good. Oh no. I've already fought you, which is good. Yeah. Okay, don't go up there. 
What are you, what are you doing out here in the water? Okay, this is... I don't want to go up there, I just want to know where... Yes. I don't know where I am. don't know my name, I don't know where I am. All, is, all I know is that I must kill. now. Okay, the bats are everywhere. Don't want to fight her. If I can avoid it, which it looks like I can't. Damn. Yep. <coughs> okay. Fight these uh, sable eye things. Okay. Yep. Skarmory! And I do not have my. Uh... Oh, good! Yeah, oh, no, great. Okay, that wipes out Skarmory. Sable eye coming out. Very little can stand up against a surf. Okay. Uh, bridge? I guess? <sighs> surf. And it's a double battle. <sighs> okay, Swamper. What will Swamper do? Nice. Uh, wing attack on that lantern. Yeah, I shouldn't see that coming. Why don't you take the Medicham out? Medicham? I don't know. But out comes another clay doll, which means that my Pelper dies. Oof. Swamper. Gonna use mud shot on that lantern. No, we don't need protect. Use skill swap. I have, I guess. Okay, that again. Nice! See. Please game, let me have full vision. I've been here before because I picked up that item there. But now what? That is the question.
Where am I? Okay. Got my bearings. This should be good. Can't learn flash, so this cave is damn near impossible. And by can't learn flash, I mean I don't want to waste a move on it. Notice that there's this. Uh, I can't get to it that way. Got it. There is a little thing. Yep. Here, gotta take the waterfall up. Uh, and then. Oh my god. I think I wanna do this right now. Please don't faint. You can make it through. Okay, so where's that put me? That puts me there. Okay. Oh my god, another trainer. Why did so many? It's actually a big problem. Do I have a max revive? Probably not. I do have an extra vibe. Do I want to waste it though? That's the question. Well, do I have any normal revives? I do have a normal revive. So let's normal revive. An electric. Uh, and let's normal revive. Pelipper. So they're my typical carries, and they're much higher level than my Swampert is. So, goodbye, Swampert. I'm so sorry. Uh, great, Thunder. Um, yeah, to deal with Absol, we'll go to Pelipper. There you go. Good job. Alright, so we defeated that one. And now we gotta go around her. Oh my god. Bite, because Slim Town is psychic. Now comes Soul Rock. No. Bite again, because I'm psychic. Okay, never met anyone like you before. Damn right. Okay, Manectric will. Manectric will run away? Yeah. Okay, so there should be. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh wait, just run. Yeah, rock smash. Okay, and now push this. Yep, down. Good. And break this one. Okay. Matter. Now we can see again. Great. Uh, we're just gonna run from this. Good. It's not Gen two, so we can just run away from things. What the hell is that thing? Okay. Teleper. Yep, I will. <coughs> oh, you know what? Manectric doesn't have any... Oh, moves left. That stinks. Oh, my phone just shut down. So that's not great. Oh, no, double battle. That's not what I wanted. Oh god. Okay, so this is not great. I'm gonna bite the Gardevoir and surf. Okay, that is great. Oh my god. Oh, Thunderbolt. Got it. Weird. Okay. Strength on that one and surf. Oof. Okay, that was lucky. Dust bombs. Surf. And surf again. Okay. So that defeats those two trainers. That was a pain. Wish that had not been a double battle. That cost me an electric. And we're finally out. 
And we're in Evergrande City again. Which is very pretty. Entering Pokemon League Center Gate. Wow. That is a big building. Alright, sure enough. Uh, standard Pokemon League. Yep. Alright, thank you. And this is probably a shop. Okay, so I now have $185,000, which is great. Um, I am going to buy some full restores. No. Full restore. Ten. Yeah. Thank you. Um, and let's see. We should probably... Uh, actually, no. We should, what we need... Oh, what we need are some revives. Yeah, might as well. Um, that didn't even cost that much, so... Yeah, I might as well just keep buying foresters. I have the money for it, so yeah. And... Anything else we might need? I honestly should just buy more revives. And let's buy some 10 max potions, just in case. Again, we have the money for it. We've spent most of our, I think we just dropped 130k, but that's fine. Um, so before we actually go into this, I do want to check if we have any HMs or TMs that um, might be valuable here. So we do have Rock Tomb. Uh, we do have Aerial Ace. Aerial Ace has power 60. Can't be avoided. So, Pelipper wants to use it. Already knows four moves. Should it be deleted? Yeah. Um, so, I think Wing Attack is going to be the is kind of defunct because this one can't be avoided. So we'll just get rid of Wing Attack and we'll replace it with uh, Aerial Ace. Nice. So that's just kind of a better Wing Attack, lower chance of uh, missing. And let's see if anyone can learn Fire Blast. Probably not. Nope. Okay, so can't do Fire Blast. How about, I'm guessing Overheat is the same deal. No one can learn that. Great. Um, how about Psychic? Mm hmm Nope. No one can learn Psychic. Great. Uh, we do have Thunder as a... Hyper Beam, probably not worth it. Earthquake. Yes. Swamper can learn this one. Uh, yes. So, I am going to replace Mudshot, which is power 55, with Earthquake, power 100. Because that is better. Great. We also have a TM for Blizzard. Not sure if anyone can learn it. Uh, Caliper and Swampert can both learn it. So one thing I would consider doing here is... Um, let's see if this works. I don't think it will. Can we override dive? Nope. We cannot, which means that all those moves are staying. Look at Ice Beam. I'd like to see if... So Pelper can learn Ice Beam. Um, so I think I'm gonna replace Protect with Ice Beam. 
This protector's kind of niche. It helped me through that Norman fight, but I don't think it will be super valuable going forward. Okay, so we have... I'm trying to think of if there's a, like a major kind of... I guess toxic would be... No, because if I'm against a grass type... Water pulse? What's the power on that? 60. I don't think I can really replace any of the water moves though. Bulk up. Hidden power. Thunder. Facade. Secret power. Thief. Skill swap. And overheat. So a lot of those I just can't use. Okay, so I'm going to save for the first time tonight, apparently. Cool, cool. And let's talk to these boys. Yeah, that'd be me. Yeah, out the way. Out the way, please. Okay, up the stairs we go and through the door. All right, I'm Sydney of the Elite Four. I like that look you give me. I guess you give me a good match. That's good, looking real good. Okay, I have no idea what any of these um, leaders or elites types are, so I could have a really bad order set up here. Um, I'm gonna find out. All right. So, Elite Four Sydney would like to battle. We got Mighty Yina first off, and Manectric going out. Attack drops. That's fine. Hope that Thunder hits. It does. So, that should be Mighty Yina down. Mighty Yina down. Manectric with some gained exp. Is that Shiftry? I think it was. In that case, we're switching. And out comes Shiftry. Grass Dark. So, hit him with the Aerial Ace. Can't miss. Super effective, but does not down him. That's a bummer. Okay. Aerial Ace again. And that's a crit. And he's down. Lots of exp there. About to use Absol. Will I change Pokemon? Nope. Absol coming out. Hit him with Ye Old Surf. Should be an effort. Oh. He hung on. Attack Rose. That's not good. He's going to pop a berry. Aerial Ace, can't miss. Use the full restore. Great. And there we go. And Surf should take him out. I'm so fainted. <laughs> Folks, I'm going to shift you over to the BRB screen for just a moment here, but I'll be right back.
Okay, folks, I am back. So last, we were halfway through this first elite battle. Um, just Brandy was headed out on her walk. I want to wish them well. And out comes Cacturn. I'm not going to switch Pokemon here. And Cacturn coming out. I'm going to use that Aerial Ace against him. Just check the chat, make sure I'm not missing anything. Um, oh, Mark in the chat asks. Yeah. Uh, my alarm's going off. Nah. Okay. Ooh, cotton spore. What does that do? Speed lowered? Yeah. That stays. Ah, uh, and the full restore. Okay. Should still allow me to blah, bop, bop, bop. Faint attack coming out. He is now faster than me. That kind of stinks. Only a little bit of health loss, though. So there we go. Elite Force Sydney is about to use Quadant. Yes, because we're going to just switch right over to Manectric. Hope for that thunder to hit. I think at this point. Yes! Clutch as hell. Thank you, Thunder. And yeah, that should do it. Can I have one more Pokemon? Okay, Mark asked that like six minutes ago. Oops. Did the thing. Got the thing. Elite Force Sydney. I lost. It doesn't matter. Okay, so that is Elite 1 down, 3 to go. Got what it takes to go far. Well, thank you. Um, in the bag, we have some now kind of defunct proportions. So we're going to burn one of those healing up helper, because might as well. And let me just make sure my sound... Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, sounds right. Okay. And we're going to save again. And second, three, seventeen. Okay. And here we go. Up the stairs again, through the door. And we're into the this room. I'm Phoebe of the Elite Four. I did my training on that pyre. I've been there. Uh-oh, she gained the ability to... Shit, 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 shit. Don't worry, I can inflict damage because I know dark move. I think dark is strong against ghosts. That might be wrong. Phoebe sent out Dusclops. Dusclops, I am hoping, is weak to bite. Really? Not amused. Not amused by that. Chomp, 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 chomp. Yep. Okay. Super effective move. Ooh, the Confuse Ray. Not great. You know what I forgot to do? I forgot to give anyone, literally anyone, a berry. Uh, I was confused, but he used Bite anyway. No, I didn't. Damn it. Shadow Punch coming in. And that's a big hit. But. Fuck you! Okay, we're out of confusion. That's really good. Use the bite. Failed. Chomp, chomp. That should take care of it. Okay, Dusclops is down. Really hate that confusion. Bad to use... No. You fucker. Uh, bite. Okay, bite should bring him to half health. Does not. This is a higher level Dusclops. Wow. Earthquake. KOs me, I think. Nope, not quite. Um, just hyper pushing him back up, I guess. If it's another earthquake, yeah. 
How much does that actually drop me? From 151 to 9. Because it crit. Okay, so what we're gonna do is bring out the Pelper. Great. And that misses. Okay. Surf? Surf's kind of my go-to. And it works. Cool. I don't know what Banette is, so... No, not gonna change. Uh, I don't know what that is. So, Surf. When in doubt, just use Surf. That's a lot of XP. Another Banette coming out. So, Surf worked last time. Let's try Surf again. Hands off that space bar. And Surf again. Downs Banette. Sweet. That could also be Bennett. I'm not sure. About to use Sableye. Nah. We're gonna surf right through this gem. Or the. This. Leader? I don't know what to call her. We're gonna surf right through this, though. And that is a th fifth Pokemon down. Fucking Sableyes. Oh, right. I've gone and lost then, mate. Why is she. What is she wearing? Okay, well. There's a definite bond between you and your Pokemon, too. Whoa, we're halfway there. Whoa. Living on a Pelipper. And we're just gonna save real quick. Emerald 3rd 317. Okay. Oh, excuse me. Before we go on, let us, are we hungry? Heal. And we're all back to full. Thank you, everyone. Let's move on. And through the door. All right. Oh, so this is the one that Sermina said she was going to struggle with. Yep. Two down, three to go. I mean, two down, two to go for the Elite Four. Just got to beat the champion after that. Whoever the champion is, don't know who it is. Okay, so this, I think, was the one that Sumina was worried about. Now we're going to use Thunder. Yes! Okay, that makes this a little easier. I think. I hope. I know! So the beauty of the this being an Ice Gem is unless she has... What is that? Glalie? What are you? And Thunder hits again. So I'm gonna hope that that KOs. Nice. Okay. Um, I think this is the gym that Sermina was saying she was gonna really struggle with. Because this is probably a gym that has ice type moves. Um, fortunately for me... So that's gonna hit every turn for a small amount of damage. I don't think Celio takes the damage because he's an ice type, but any non ice types will take the damage. So because Sermina has an all grass team, I think everyone on her team will be um, weak to ice moves. And that's gonna be a problem. Uh, will I change the point? No, I will not. I'm just gonna go for Thunders all the way through here. That's gonna be another 9 points of health. Dropping me to 133. Just gonna try to hit Thunder all the way through. Because it would be nice. Oh, wow. Ooh, don't freeze me, don't freeze me, don't freeze me. Uh... Whoa! Massive damage on that. Okay, that sucked. Um, so Ice Beam. Crazy strong. Cool. Good to know. 
Hail can do this fall. It's going to hurt me a lot, actually. going to really hope I get to move first. Yep. Surf through this. Yeah. Retrospectively, bring out the flying type to handle the ice move. Not very smart, actually. Um, okay. So we've got... Wall Rain coming up. And... No, I will not. Okay, that is a definite water type. Maybe also a nice type. Another, what, 10 points of health there? Yep. And so Ice Beam is probably not going to be the best move here. Let's try Surf. Really relying on the high. Okay, that's not great. Ice Beam might KO me, not going to lie. Oh, uh, nope. But not by much. So I am going to try. Let's throw a max revive here. Let me do this on electric. That is going to cost Pelipper his life. Sorry, Pelipper. And for effective. True. That will allow me to bring out Manectric. Uh who I think still has a thunder up his sleeve. Yep. And it hits. Great. Big bolt of lightning there. And that chaos. And that gets us through the ice gem with only two feints. Okay, cool. How hot your spirits burn. Burn, baby, burn. Yep. And I did all of that without fire blast. Very cool. Although Fire Blast wouldn't be great against that gem, because... Okay, before we move on, uh, let's do some reviving. So we have 27 revives. We'll use one of them on Pelver. And... Hyper Potion to get the rest of the health back. This brings me to the question of... Why the hell... That... I hear you, Ben. Let's use the Zinc on... Oh, it won't have any. Let's use the zinc on electric. It won't have any. Let's use the zinc on swamper. Great. Thumbs up. Um, is there anything we can give to Manectric to help him out? Um. Mm -hmm. I guess we could give him a berry. Let's build a block ingredient. I'm gonna go corn with that. I'm gonna go corn with that. Not the berry. Heals a burn, heals poisoning, heals paralysis. Let's. Hmm. Yeah, let's give this to um, Manectric. Because that way he will be able to just heal those PP on. I think that's the right save. And there we go. Up the stairs we go. Okay, so I think that's three down with two to go. And let me just check and make sure I did the right things. I don't have anything else we want to give to. Yeah, I guess these are only things I can... Things only I can use. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so we're ready. Uh, this is Captain Drake, the Dragon Master. Well, Drake, I wish you'd painted some dragons on the wall or something, because I would really have liked to uh, put Pelipper out front. All right, my dude. That is a cool jacket. 
Elite Four Drake sent out Shelgon. Do not know my typings for many of these. Any of these? Any of these. Pretty sure the way to go here is Pelipper. Because if I remember correctly, Ice is strong against dragons. Ha! Now that means he won't really be able to use... Are you kidding me? This fucking Shelgon is like the one Pokemon in the world that can use Protect twice. But we hit him with the Ice Beam anyway, so it doesn't matter. Boom. Okay, so that deals with Shelgon, who was probably not the enemy that we were... Oh, this is the gen of Salamence. I have a Salamence in Pokemon Go. No, I will not, because we're going to hit him with the Ice Beam. Out comes the Salamence. That is a cool-looking dragon. That is like a dragon-looking dragon. I appreciate that. Dragonite never looked like a dragon to me. But this guy, Salamence? Oh my god. He knows Rock Slide. Wow. Uncalled for. So that was 68 points of health. But he just lost all of his, so... Interestingly, we're getting into some fast Pokemon here, because that Salamence just outspeeded me. Hmm. Altaria coming in. So I'm not going to change, because Pelipper knows Ice Beam. Ice Beam is going to be doubly super effective against the Dragon type and the Flying type. So that's a knockout against Altaria. And here comes Kingdra. For Kingdra, yes, I will switch because I'd like to use the Thunder. Alright. Oh, I missed. Dragon Dance, so that's Attack Up. And the speed up, which is not great because he might outmove me. Um, but he's just going to use Dragon Dance again. Not sure the AI called that one correctly. Thunder. Kaboom. And it's not a full knockout. That's a bummer. Okay, that's kind of cool. Wow, that fully restores Thunder's PP. Very nice. And the Body Slam. Which hit for a bazillion. Cool. Oh my god. Surf. Knockout. Oof. Alright. Swampert coming in. Swampert's my lowest level. Not expecting him to necessarily... Like, win this for me. Kind of hope he will, though. Earthquake. Just hoping the Kingdra's not flying, and he's not. So we did make it through. Well, wait, no. He's got one more, doesn't he? Uh, let's see. Yep, out comes Flygon, who is Ground Dragon. I always think that Flygon is a flying type, but he's not. Yes, I will. Out comes Pelipper. The advantage of the Pelper here, not only does he know Ice Beam, he's also a Flying type. So, I can get away with using a Flying move. Um, but let's start with Aerial. Ooh! Okay. That did not do as much damage as I was expecting. Start with the Ice Beam. And end with the Ice Beam, because that's a one-hit KO. Well done, Pelper. Well done to my very overleveled team. So that, ladies and gentlemen, is the Gen 3 Elite 4. You do seem to know what is needed. What a trainer needs is a virtuous heart. Trainers touch the good hearts of trainers. Pokemon touch the good hearts of trainers and learn good from wrong. The champion is waiting. Okay, so because the champion's waiting, we're gonna go to the bag. I mean, not because the champion's waiting, just, you know. 
Please revive. Revive up that metric. Wait. Oh, not the caliber. Got it. I wish the selection selecting was a little more clear. Sumina's been talking about the champ like all game, but not telling us who it is. And so I'm curious now. I think I know, but I'm not sure. And I don't want to like spoil that now. Because so Okay. I also took that berry away from What's his name? So I'm going to give him the cherry berry. I'll give him the cherry berry to the next track. No, 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 I want to just give it to him. Give him the cherry berry. Okay, hold on to the cherry berry. And we're going to save. I'll just overwrite that last one. And go ahead and up the stairs we go. Those are cool lights. Oh, they're like da, da, lights. Oh, wow, we're at the top of the platform. And it's Wallace! So Wallace is the grand champion? Wow. I was not expecting that. I thought it would be Steven, honestly. Let's do it. Let's do it, Wallace. I'm happy to be facing you. Oh my god, that is the biggest cape I think I've ever seen. Champion Wallace would like to battle. Sent out Whale Lord. Honestly, my dude, that's a mistake. Shouldn't have done that. And it hits. That probably won't. That does it. Okay, well done, Manectric. Level 57, Manectric, taking down a literal whale in one hit. He's about to use Gyarados, and no, I will not. Um, I almost don't want to fuck around with Thunder here, but I'm going to. And it missed. Okay, so Dragon Dance probably means he outspeeds me now. Although I am an electric type, like my speed is pretty high. Oh no, 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 no. That's gonna be a knockout. Yep. Okay, so this means we're probably going to, let's see, Pelipper. Pelipper coming out, that way if he spams Earthquake again. We will just dodge it. Surf is a no-go. Flying is a no-go. Ice kind of works. He is a water type, so I think that resists the ice. But... Yeah, and we really... I don't think we can put... Um, oh, that is not the amount of damage I was hoping to do with that. And that's going to be a lot of damage. Nope, since I'm water type. That's, that's fine. Okay, so I'm just gonna chip at him with Aerial Ace. What I actually might do is just. Oh, no, 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 that's not good. Oh, no. That's a knockout. Okay. Um. So, Swampert, going in. Gyarados is flying. So we cannot use... I mean, we need to burn a Max Revive here, because... Wow, this is not a great situation. Okay, Manectric coming back. Must recharge, which is the only reason I'm alive. And fighting's not gonna work. Earthquake's not gonna work. Really, my only option here are waterfall and dive. Uh, Swamper summary. Um, yeah. 
so waterfall power 80, dive power 60. Okay, we're going with waterfall. Oh, the earthquake. Okay, but I am ground. I think I'll survive this. Yep. With 2 HP. And I think that was the... Wow. Wow. Gonna stall for a second. Yep, full restore. So that sucks. Um... Fighting's gonna be totally ineffective. Out of max revives. I do have a lot of revives left. So I'm gonna use one of those in Pelipper. Hyper Beam? Probably gonna knock out this uh, Swampert. That does mean he's taking a turn to recharge. While he's doing that, we're gonna send out Manectric. And hit him with the first of several shockwaves. And there's a knockout. Okay. That was tough. Um, glad we made it through that. Got to use Wish Cash. Um, I think I need to, because Wish Cash is the water ground. And just gonna burn the first round doing a heal. I think we have a hyper potion left. Okay, and let's see what does Wish Cash have. Okay, so there's the Amnesia coming through that's gonna raise his own, I think, special defense. Uh, gonna go back to the bag, and we're gonna burn a revive, getting the Swampert back up. Because if he has a water ground, then I want my water ground. Surf coming through shouldn't do too much damage. While that's going on, and use burning moves. We're gonna use that other hyper potion to get Swampert all the way back up. Great. Amnesia coming through, so that special defense going up again. That's gonna be a pain in the butt. Because we don't... Well, actually, Aerial Ace, physical move. Just have no physical attack. So that stinks. Um, try surf. His special defense is going to be really high. So, yeah, that's not going to do a lot. We're just sending the wave back and forth, back and forth. Uh, okay. Fly is 120 power. Aerial is 60. Might as well keep spamming it. Not gonna do a whole lot here, but that's fine. Uh, better safe than sorry. Let's just burn a max potion on developer. Another aerial ace. I'm waiting for the full restore from Wallace. Hyper Beam? Why does everyone know Hyper Beam? I call bullshit on that one. He doesn't need a turn to recharge. I am expecting a full restore out of Wallace. Yep. Okay. Bullshit. Aerial Ace chips in town. So 
Surf coming through. Not very effective. Um, gonna burn another Max Potion. Yep. Hyper Beam. Wish I had flown instead of Aerial Aced. Go up. Must recharge. Aerial Ace. Okay. Another Hyper Beam. So that should do another 53. Drops to 76. Five. Please fly. Up we go. Must recharge. And fly to the face. Oh my god. I swear to god if he's got a full restore. Okay, we got him. Whew! Voice cash. Pain in the ass. Pelipper, level 60. Let's go. Yeah, that 88 attack. Tentacruel coming through. Um, yeah. Manectric, my dude, it's your time to shine. Uh, Tentacruel coming out. Do I want to fuck around with Thunder again? That's what got me into trouble earlier. I'm going to do it. And it missed again. <laughs> yep, there's that Toxic. I was expecting a poison move. And I'm badly poisoned. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Try to land the Thunder first. Okay, great. And the paralysis, very good. Hydro pump coming out shouldn't affect me too much. It does, it affects me all the way. <laughs> um, out comes Swampert. And if we are really unlucky here, this is a KO, but we're hoping that that doesn't happen. Gonna try the earthquake. Full restore. Okay, that's gonna get rid of the paralysis too, which sucks. Um, okay. And earthquake does not kill him. Hydro pump shouldn't hit me too hard because of the water type being great. Earthquake gets me through. So now we're in a little bit of a pinch. Need to revive. Awesome. Ludicolo coming out. Yep. Need that Pelper. And we're gonna have to burn the first turn, dropping a Max Potion on him. This is where Swampert, as that starting, is actually gonna hurt us. So, Pelper. I really hope. Okay, evasion up, but that's fine because we have aerial ace, which cannot miss. So regardless of your evasion being high, we're gonna smack you. It's super effective, brings him to half health. He used double team again. Perfect. AI is an idiot. Um, I'm guessing that this Ludicolo has a bunch of moves that are useless against a water flying type. Oh my god. And he used double team again. Okay, so this is the AI working in our favor because it's trying to use the only move it knows how to use. Oh my god. Just hit him with the ice beam. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Okay, he was at like two health. What? Alright, just hit him with the ice beam. And it does very little. I was really hoping I was gonna do more than that. While that's happening, we're going to use a revive on this Manectric. Because we need some living people. Why didn't you use that in the first place? That would have been way smarter. Yeah. Um, and... I 
do have a PP up. I also have a PP max. Double team out again. So, because he's almost at full anyway, I'm gonna just max potion the Pelipper. Because he's just going to keep spamming double team. Which is fine, don't care about that. But while he's doing that, we can just heal the team to full. Yeah, because Giga Drain is going to hurt. Maybe half my health again. No, not half my health, so that's great. Um, and use another max potion to get Swampered up. Man, if anyone on this team could learn Fire Blast. If anyone on this team could learn Fire Blast, I would be so happy right now. But, okay, so we're gonna fly. Because I'm expecting a good drain. Yep, and it missed. And smack him in the face. And I missed, which I didn't realize I could do with fly. Great. So, unfortunately, I think his effect, his evasiveness is maxed. So we're gonna fly, yep, because he's now spamming Giga Drain. And we missed again because, right, for some reason he used Surf on me. Okay. I forgot that his evasiveness was crazy high. So fly is not gonna land. So we are gonna have to use Aerial Ace which just doesn't have a lot of power behind it, but that's fine. What we gotta go with. It also is doubling. Oh my god. So this guy knows what? Weed Seed, Giga Drain, um, Surf, and uh, Double Team. We got to see all four moves out of a Pokemon. I don't think we've actually gotten to see that yet. There goes the Surf. If he uses a full restore, I'm gonna be so mad. Oh, and that leech seed is gonna hit me. I'm gonna go for the aerial ace. Try to take him out. That does it. Great. Okay. Might be a faint on Pelper because of that. And out comes Melodic. Who? Oh! Yes. Okay, so out comes Melodic, I think is a water type, if I'm imagining Melodic correctly. Yep, great. Okay, so he's got the water type, which I can hit with Shockwave. Squeaky chair. A little bit. Whoa, that didn't do the amount of damage I was expecting to. Oh my god, everybody's toxic in me today. Report Wallace for Toxic. Hit him with the Shockwave again. Here comes, like, I don't know, a Hyper Beam or something. Milotic. Is that what we're going with? Milotic? Milotic? Uh, Manectric is hurt. Oh, it's Manectric versus Milotic. Nice. Boom. Okay, Shockwave nails it again. Out comes the Surf, which I'm hoping does not KO me. It does not, but that might. Nope, survived it. And the Berry restores some health. So what we're going to do is a good old full restore. Just bring him back to full. And that also gets rid of the Toxic Poison, which she's probably not going to use that time because she didn't realize I no longer have it. That hit for a whole lot. So I'm just going to max pot. And another surf. Which, once again, hits for a lot. I don't know what my goal is here. 
And there's the surf. Okay, this is a vicious cycle, so I think. I don't know what to do here, honestly. I think if I go for a Thunder, it might be enough to knock her out. But I missed. On every crucial Thunder, this, uh, this Elite Four, I have missed. Three for three. Okay, so Swampert's coming out. That's gonna be the stall. And we're immediately going to go to the bag, and I'm not going to bother maxing that Manectric right now. I'm going to max the Pelipper. And then once I get the chance, my next move is going to be the... Okay, Toxic, great. Um, don't care about that. Badly poisoned, that's fine. What we need is to fight and hit with, hopefully, Earthquake. Surf is going to hit for a lot. Okay. It didn't hit for all, though, so we're good. Earthquake should hit for a lot. Not as much as I wanted. Bag. Going to go for another full restore. Swampert is tanky as hell. Thank you. Ice Beam. Hopefully will not knock me out. Earthquake again. Surf also hopefully will not knock me out. Oh, clinging to life. Earthquake comes through. And we're good. We are in the clear. We have done it. Good job, Swamper. Clinging to life. We defeated Wally. We defeated the champion. And we are done with Emerald. Oh my god, they gave me $11,000 for winning, which is good because I just spent probably like 60. <sighs> I did not strike like lightning ever because I missed every thunder I needed to hit. <laughs> you stand at the glorious peak of the Pokemon League. I proclaim you to be the new Hoenn region. May, you are late. <laughs> Oh, it's Professor Birch! You finally done it. I was so worried that May was gonna challenge me to a battle right now and just utterly destroy me. Ah, yes. What became of your Pokedex? You've <laughs> got. I have seen 138 Pokemon and I have caught 13. I guess you're getting the hang of it, but it gets harder from here. Yeah, no, I, I did not do a good job with the Pokedex. Flynn, no, let me rephrase that properly. I mean, it's my name. The new champion. Okay, yeah, I like the ring of that. Why is May following us? May, you're not the champion. I'm the champion. No matter. Oh, I like that the floor has reflections. Yes, we prevailed through harsh battles. Excellent. And it's only going to record three names because this was the three Pokemon challenge for Gen 3. What up? <sighs> Don't turn off the power. I will not. I will definitely not. All right. Manectric, level 57. Pelipper, level 60. And Swampert, level 47. Yay, welcome to the Hall of Fame. I like that's just three of them. I really appreciate it. I, I really like that. That's cool. Flynn played for only 23 hours this time. Great. Um, and my ID number was 39957. <sighs> Pokemon Emeralds version credits. Guys, I am so happy. Thanks for you all for tuning in tonight. This was a blast. Um, that guy's riding his mock bike way better than I ever could. Get to see all the uh, artists on the game now. A lot of programmers. 
I don't know who any of these people are. I'm assuming Sermina knows the music people. Oh, was Go? I think Go was the person that Sermina said last time. Was the uh, big music person. Scenario plot. Scenario. Script designers. Map designers. Battle frontier data. Parametric designers. There's a lot of stuff that went into this. Environment and tool planners. Pokemon designers. More Pokemon designers. I guess that makes sense. There were also a lot more Pokemon this gen. Thank you, Noah, for believing in me. Appreciate it. Support program. Why is that girl going so fast on my bike? I don't know what the NCL was. Oh, Super Mario Club. Special thanks to these two. Special thanks to these four. Special thanks to these three. Special thanks to these three. And we had information supervisors. No idea what they do. Artwork. You guys did a great job. This game looks way better than the last generation. More artwork. Makes sense. We have some coordinators. Oh, I'm catching up to the girl on the bike. English version coordinators. There's a translator. Wow, a lot of people contributed to this game. Guess that makes sense. More NCL stuff. More programmers. Uh, another graphic designer. Lots of people. Very lots of people. NOA product testing. No idea what that is. Rail code check? Can you do... How does Braille factor into these games? I'm confused by that. That's okay. And the executive director. And the executive producers. They each get their own thing. I like that. And night falls over the end credits of Pokemon Emerald. The end. But is it? Yes, it is. <sighs> okay. Pokemon Emerald. Continue. All right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave. Oh, hey, it's uh, is that my dad? Yeah, it is. Mr. Briny, I obtained the SS ticket. Woohoo! Oh. Oh. Did he just call her? Okay, whatever. <laughs> All he talks about is work. Is basically what she just said. Breaking news story. Uh oh. Emergency news flash. There have been reports of colored Pokemon in flight. I bet it's a green colored Pokemon in flight. Guess so. Thought it was green, but whatever. Oh, gotta talk to Professor Birch. Then I can save and go. The national mode, very cool. Okay, I remember this raising a big fuss when it came to Sword and Shield because the Poke Pokedex in Sword and Shield was not a national dex. Um, and it looks like what's happening is in Emerald, these are actually being upgraded to national mode. I have not actually checked the numbers on the Pokemon, so I guess I don't know where they are. Okay. Well, everyone, thanks again for watching. Um, this was actually my, I mean, I guess this was the end of my Emerald journey. Um, save as last. And um, it was really, really fun. The graphics in this game were super cool. The story was awesome. And um, as we saw today, like, the, the end of the game posed a real challenge, especially if you only have uh, three Pokemon to work with. So that was super cool. I had a great time. Um... 
And I'm looking forward to see what happens in Gen 4, which I'm not even going to be playing for another two weeks. Um, so until then, like, stay tuned, because I might try to do, like, a legendary thing where I go around and catch, um, at least Rayquaza, um, but possibly the other ones. I don't really know what I can catch. Um, probably just Kyogre, I guess, since this is... Well, actually, I don't know, because this is Emerald. So, not red or blue. Who knows? Anyway... I'll look into whether I can do a uh, legendary hunt kind of stream thing, but I have not done that yet because I'm really, I'm not sure if you guys are aware of this, I'm not good at catching Pokemon. So, um, might do that, might not do that. I do have the Master Ball, so that's a guaranteed, guaranteed catch on at least one of them, but whether I want to do that or not is in question. Of course, I think... The SS ticket is going to be able to take me somewhere, so I'm going to have to check that out. So at some point, you'll definitely get another stream from me um, in Emerald before we move on to Gen 4. But um, for now, this is Peter, and I'm signing off for the last time in Gen 3. Bye!